So in this video, I'm going to talk about estimating the duration of time in minutes. So let's take for example, we have time started at 8.24 in the morning and time ended at 8.38 in the morning. And we want to know the estimated elapsed time in minutes. And so we basically get the elapsed time by subtracting the time ended from the time started but we usually um, want to get a quick estimated elapsed time and so that's the reason why we need to learn estimation because that's the quickest way to get the closest exact uh, value that is estimation and so, how to estimate this? We're going to round the minutes into the nearest uh, minute. So we're going to look at the ones digit of the minute, which is 8. And if it's 5 or above, then we're going to round it up. So since it's 38, it will become 40, as well as to the minute at the bottom it's 24 so since the once digit is 4 so it's below 5 then we're going to round down so it becomes 20 and this is the time we're going to subtract and so 40 minus 20 is 20 and 8 minus 8 is 0 so the estimated elapsed time is 20 minutes So another example, we have time started at 11.46 in the morning and it ended at 12.25 in the afternoon. So what is the estimated elapsed time? So we are going to arrange it first with the time ended minus the time started. And then we round off the minutes. So since it's 25, it ended with 5. So if it's 5 or above, we are going to round up. So it becomes 30 and for the bottom minutes it's 46 so it ends with 6 so we also round this up to 50 then we subtract so we subtract from right to left starting from minutes but we cannot subtract 30 by 50 because the one on top is smaller than the bottom so what we're going to do is to borrow from ours and we have to remember that 1 hour is 60 minutes and so we're going to subtract 1 from hour and put it in minutes so we're going to add 60 minutes so this 12 becomes 11 and 30 becomes 90 because 30 plus 60 is 90 then we continue we subtract 90 minus 50 is 40 so 11 minus 11 is 0 and so the estimated elapsed time is 40 minutes so let's have another example we have time started at 7.52 in the afternoon or in the evening and time ended at 8.13 in the evening so what's the elapsed time or estimated elapsed time for this so let's arrange it first with the time ended minus the time started so before we subtract, we are going to round off to make it easier for us to subtract because that's the main reason why we estimate to make it faster. So 13, round it off, it will become 10 because 3 is below 5. Also with 52, it ends with 2, so it's below 5. We are going to round down as well, it becomes 50. Then we subtract. Now our problem is we cannot subtract 10 by 50 because the one top is smaller. And so we're going to borrow from 1 hour, I mean from 8, borrow 1 hour, and put it in minutes, which is 60 minutes. And so 8 becomes 7, and 10 becomes 10 plus 60 is 70. Now we subtract 70 minus 50 is 20, 7 minus 7 is 0. So the estimated elapsed time is 20 minutes. Thanks for watching and I hope you have learned from this video. Please support my channel by pressing the subscribe button. 
and write the mod topics you want to learn in the comment section.